Carnegie Mellon University is the exclusive higher education partner of the Tony Awards and co-founder of the Excellence in Theater Education Award. Each year, the Tonys and CMU conduct a nationwide search to recognize a drama teacher for his or her exceptional commitment to arts education. To announce this year's Education Award winner, it's our great pleasure to welcome CMU's president, Dr. Farnam Jahanian, the head of CMU's School of Drama, Dr. Peter Cook, and from the company of choir boy, CMU alumnus, John Clay III. Good evening. We want to begin by sharing our best wishes and congratulations to the five CMU alumni who are among tonight's Tony Award nominees. Jamie DeRoy, Peggy Eisenhower, Jules Fisher, Peter Helinski, and Ann Roth. We also wish to congratulate Michael McElroy, Tony Honoré, and Judith Light, this year's Isabel Stevenson Tony winner. Your CMU family is so proud of you. As home to the first degree granting drama program in the United States, Carnegie Mellon University is pleased to join our colleagues at the Broadway League and the American Theater Wing to celebrate arts education by recognizing extraordinary teachers from across the country. This is the fifth anniversary of the Excellence in Theatre Education Award, and as a judge for all five years, I can tell you the bar has been raised higher than ever. This year's winner is a standout in her Charlottesville, Virginia community, and to educators everywhere, theatre director Madeline Michael from Monticello High School. Ms. Michael empowers her students to confront social injustice, to address racial inequality, and to bring those conversations forward with inclusive stage performances. Let's take a look at this outstanding educator. Questions we ask are about a theater educator who most inspired you. Marilyn McCormick. Ken Washington. Lori Sales. Miss Free. Clyde Fowler. Ruth Strand. She changed my life. This drama department pushes boundaries. This program always chooses to have a message. It's art with a message and art with real people behind it. Art is really expression. It's supposed to be free. This program is not about me. It has to be about them. They are our future. They are the kids that give me so much hope. So making our world about them is the most uplifting thing that I could possibly think of. We are honored to present the 2019 Excellence in Theater Education Award to Madeline Michael. I would like to thank the Broadway League, the American Theater Wing, and Carnegie Mellon University for this award. I'm proud to share this award with my students at Monticello High School. I share this award with Josh St. Hill, who like everyone else in Charlottesville, suffered through the white supremacist violence of August 2017. And like everyone else in the black community, he was not surprised by it. That fall, he wrote the rap narrative one-act play, A King's Story, set against the backdrop of that tragic summer. I share this award with Courtney Grooms, who, galled by her classmates' Confederate flag t-shirts, wrote the play, Necessary Trouble, the title inspired by civil rights icon, Congressman John Lewis. I share this award with Kayla Scott, who experienced racial profiling in our increasingly gentrified city. From this came her award-winning play, Hashtag Wild Black. 
I share this award with Thaddeus Lane, who thought he was exclusively a basketball player and now is an integral member of our city's community theater. I share this award with Alex Espinosa, a dreamer who fell in love with In the Heights and is now a college theater major. I share this award with Amaya, Tyasia, Atalia, Moasia, who never saw girls that looked like them on high school stages and have now set the standard for all students in our community. I share this award with Tyler, Abigail, Will, Zoe, Laurel, fervent allies of their peers of color who never asked the question, what about me? This award is for all of the students who have found their voice and who speak for themselves, their families, and their community through theater and playwriting. I thank you all for allowing me to accompany you on this journey, a journey that I invite everyone to follow on Instagram at Monticello Drama 19. Thank you.